Vanaveru Vanaveru Mushi Moya Miranda Ross Miranda Jenya Sai. I'm sorry, Ukwamba Mweshmoa Malova, MCA, Kisa East, wame mudunga kisu. Huyo ni mtoto, mwenye alikuwa asmame UDA. Lakini siyasa, wenye vyama, mambo huwa ngumu sa singine. Mwishoe, akasunguka akasimama kanu na akashinda kura wamemua naenda huko sipeleki vita lakini nabali naenda vita na bahira rabasat wakana kuna rabasat venafu number one mwishmua deputy president i was in a very good mood the boy that i have killed was in my home for breakfast the other day so my mood is spoiled. Karibu. Karibu sana. Mwishmua Mdabadi. Take charge. Mwishmua Wetangula. Take charge. Kusbabu mimi na baraza tunaenda. Duguyangu. Kibet. This is a good idea. And allow me. Niambie wageni kwamba. Sirungai is a very symbolic place in the politics of William Ruto. Ili William Ruto aingie Luya Land. Mimi na Faruk Kibet. Tulikuja hapa tukatengeneza harambe ya kufana ya kujenga shule ya Sirunga E Girls. Ndiyo tukatoka hapa na message ya Deputy President then went to my home in Ekolomani did what we did the rest is, the rest is history Ruto, we are stakeholders in your government. Wakati unagawa, we are satisfied ukipatia watu wa inje, but we are more satisfied ukipatia sisi kwa sababu we are with you. Mr. Deputy President, I'm your leader of the majority team as your whip. Na siwezi zungumza against the government. I work for this government. I'm paid for this government. We worked for this government. And we will support all your agenda. Ninaomba ukirudi Nairobi. Ujue kwamba. Sisi hapa. Kiti enya ilifanya ruta kubalike haraka. Ni kwa sababu ya litupatia machine. Ya factory manyo nje. Butali sugar company. Wakati ninasungumza mambo ya Ruto kuhusu miwa watu wanaamini. Mmesema last week kwamba fact kampuni sa serikali sitakuwa privatized. Na ndani ya hizo kampuni tuko na kampuni zetu za miwa, Mzoe Sugar Company and Mumia Sugar Company. I beg you. Mimi kama kiongozi kutoka jamii yetu ya Waluya babu zetu walipeana 12,500 acres Mumia Sugar Company Wakapeana 24,500 acres Mzoye Sugar Company If you privatize Somebody will go away with ancestral land Sisi ya tuwezi unga mkono Maneno ya kuprivatize Mzoye Sugar Company And Mumia Sugar Company No We cannot And this is not out of Disrespect for the president Or the government that is the little we have in the economy of the sugar industry. If the problem is to fix the sugar industry, Your Excellency, yes, do what you are doing, but the real problem is importation of cheap sugar. Funga mfereji wakuleta cheap sugar, importers are the ones who cause problems for us. Right now, because of opening Mumias Sugar Company inafanya kazi saa hii Mumiasi inasema itanunua 5200 butali inasema itanunua 5250 
na West Kenya inasema watanua 5300 that competition ndio tunataka why are you helping your criminals let them work hard the way our farmers work hard that's a message i had for our people today bana berubaluya malaba kabaluya mundia nyala kuliza kalu wana na shiri moyo ta Your Excellency, my final point is I thank the governor of Kakamega. He is going under moving under a lot of pressure from Azimio. Kwa sababu ya maandamano. Amesimama kitete. Governor, you are on the right track. I am not cheap. We are not fighting for positions. I have a big office of Senator of Kakamega. You have a big office of governor of Kakamega let us serve our people mambo ya maandamano hapana if israel and uhuru wanataka maandamano simple simple wawache na sisi tupeane our opinion and our opinion as people of Kakamega the abeluya people we are saying as follows hii mazungumzo yenye Christians and some members of the international community mnataka iwe kati ya Raila na Ruto it must be conditional number one, Raila akitaka kuzungumza there's nothing wrong number one, akubali kwamba matokeo ya kura ya 2022 imeisha number two, akubali kwamba baada hiyo matokeo kuisha aliyetangazwa rais aliidhinishwa na mahakama ya juu the supreme court alafu wakuje tusungumze mambo ya cost of living why not na wakati wanakuja deputy president mimi sitakuwa huko waambie raila kitu ya kwanza akitaka kuzungumza cost of living wakati ashikana na raila na na Ruth, na uhuru ya salamu sisi tulikuwa tunanunua gas shilingi 500 kale katangi aliposalimiana gas hiyo ikapanda 1500 ashukishe irudi chini biashara ya gas ni ya Raila mwambie uhuru akitaka mazungumzo bei ya maziwa arudishe chini once they do that then other, the rest of us we shall make our contribution ya bana ba sadza mai banga khutsi bana ba khali ba ibula bana shi banyala khutisha ta Wera mrind. Mimi napatia ndugu yangu Faruk, eh, lakini wewe Faruk mambo yako mzuri. Shilingi 1100 kama mchango yangu, let me go for the funeral. Mheshimiwa Senator Bibi Makofi. Kwanza kabisa nachukua fursa hii kumkaribisha naibu wa rais ambaye Mheshimiwa Regadhi Gachagua Kakamega. Kakamega sisi ni watu wa amani na tumesema kwa kauli moja ya kwamba mambo ya siasa ya vita tutaki. Na nachukua fursa hii kwanza kulaani kile kitendo ambacho kimetendea kule Uisero ambapo Mheshimiwa wa anaitwa Maloba amedungwa kisu. We condemn any acts of violence in Kakamega County. Jambo la pili mimi kama gavana nilisema wazi ya kwamba mambo ya siasa tumemaliza sasa ni maendeleo. Under article 189 governors what they are supposed to collaborate with national government. Hiyo ni katiba sio mambo ya barasa. Na mimi nimesema wazi ya kwamba tutashirikiana na serikali kuu ili tuleta maendeleo hapa Kakamega County. Na hii mara yangu ya saba ama ya nane kuja hapa Malava. Nashukuru sana my brother Malulu Injendi. Tumeamua kama viongozi wa Kakamega. Barabara ni moja ya maendeleo. Jambo la mwisho najua mambo ya maandamano kile mtu alikuwa anaangalia katiba ukiangalia kipenge cha 37 kinaruhusu peaceful demonstration 
lakini tukiangalia vile vitendo ambazo zimetendeka for the last three weeks it is not peaceful demonstration ndugu zangu goons have taken over and now the idea of peaceful demonstration cannot be overemphasized kwa sababu watu wengi ukiangalia leo magazeti people are in pain people have been injured mimi kama kiongozi wa Kakamega i want to appeal to my party leader Raila Amolo Odinga it is now the highest time to have a, follow, a very peaceful discussion with William Samuel Ruto kwa sababu there is no way we can achieve economic transformation kama watu wako vitani juzi tumeona watalii walikuwa wanakuja Kenya almost 800 of them coming from Seychelles to dock in Mombasa lakini meli imeenda Zanzibar imeenda kule Dar es Salaam kwa sababu tuko na vita hapa so i want to appeal to my party leader ya kwamba it is time to put the interest of Kenyans at heart ili muongee so that as leaders we have a peaceful coexistence that is the only way we are going to have development that is the only way the cost of living itarudi chini kwa sababu leo ni siku ya maendeleo na mimi kama governor nimesema 